Sorry guys, so we got a majority of the cab over camper in the in the 13 and a half yard dumpster here. So we're gonna get the dumpster loaded um, onto the trailer. And then there's this pile. It's just a mix of just trash and dirt. So we're gonna have to get the smooth bucket and get it into my dump trailer, which is over there. So this whole area was all full of trash and metal. We took one full dumpster load of metal the other day. And then we still have all these tires and stuff to get rid of. And then there's a full load of trash in this trailer right here too. So we'll get this all loaded up, get this dumped, and then come back for all these tires. And while I'm gone, I think my father-in-law is gonna fit the rest of this stuff into my dump trailer. There's some room on one of the sides. So this will all go in there. And then all we have is the tires and the appliances to get rid of. We're all done here.
All right, guys, so this is where that cab over camper was. We ended up getting it all demoed and loaded into one of my 13 yard dumpsters. And then while I was hauling that, we just filtered through the rest of the trash and threw it in the dump trailer that was here on site already to clean up the rest of this. So all this is all cleaned up. It was a bigger job than just the cab over camper, but I just did the cab over camper part of it. Um, we ended up getting rid of about 20 yards of scrap metal that was all throughout here. And then about 12 yards of trash and about 40 tires total. So this is all cleaned up, on to the next job.